So you guys, I look crusty. It's been a couple of days. I haven't had the best luck ever. <sighs> Long story short, I ended up hurting my back. I ended up building some shelves for my closet unit. And I was trying to do all of that all by myself because you guys know I love being handy. Like I feel like I can do everything on my own. But it got to me this time. I fucked up my back and my entire like right side all the way down to my shoulder all the way down to my hand is messed up it hurts so bad it honestly hurts so bad that last night it was like unbearable like i i just could not sleep comfortably it hurt i couldn't do anything um i couldn't even lift up my arms even like right now it hurts so freaking bad i'm trying to adjust you guys a little bit better but I just i honestly have been taking a break you guys like you saw at the beginning of this video that i was building my table because i came in that was a nightmare like the assembling it part wasn't that hard it was easy for me but it was just so heavy you guys it was so heavy like i i started crying like i couldn't even take it out of the box my camera ended up dying it was just way too much i was just so like i was anxious i was overwhelmed and it got the best of me and literally like i was just i i had a hard time okay like just getting it out of that freaking box it was hell okay it was so freaking heavy but it's built okay i don't want to show you guys the table oops i don't want to show you the table just yet because i still have so much on it like as you can see it's not done i still have to like clean vacuum do all of that so i mean the table is super cute i absolutely love it but i'll show you guys oh, my phone's ringing hold on anyway i will show you guys the final table reveal maybe a little bit later in the vlog once I get everything together. I also got a new Keurig. Um, it was on sale yesterday. I went to Target. I had to pick up a few things like laundry detergent and stuff to do laundry. Um, and so I went and you guys know I needed a new Keurig. I don't want to be basic and get like an espresso type of machine. I mean, I do want one. I'm not going to lie, but... It is pretty pricey and I just, I, I'm not gonna splurge on an espresso machine right now. Um, Cause you guys know, probably like 90% of the time I enjoy my iced coffee. So I know I'm still gonna get my iced coffees. I know I'm still gonna like make them and whatnot. So whatever, I ended up just finding, I think it's the single cup Keurig, like the new one. And it was on sale, you guys. It was on sale for $50. Original price is like $90. So I was kind of excited about that. So I grabbed me one. And it's black so that it can match the entire kitchen aesthetic. Okay, you guys. So I just really want to quickly show you guys what I'm trying to do. And this is why probably today I'm going to be very like absent from vlogging. I'm trying to get everything situated. But this is basically what I'm working with. <laughs> right now i want to clear everything out i want to vacuum i want to mop i want to do so much i still have all of these all of that is closed i have to get rid of basically everything in here i moved all of my living room decor back here so that it wouldn't be like literally in the middle of the room i feel like this whole like moving series that i'm doing like i'm fucking lazy like let's be honest I'm not getting shit done. I don't know if I said it in this vlog, like in another clip, or if I said it in another vlog, but I feel like I should be already settled and I'm not like, I feel like I'm a fucking mess. If I show you guys what I have here, but before I show you that, I literally was gonna do my skincare here with you guys. Like I've been breaking out. It literally has been that time of the month and I just feel like I'm all over the place. We're just gonna start off with my Curology um moisturizer i put this guy on well if i have anything left right because i feel like i don't have anything but that's not even the way i apply it i was trying to be a little bit more aesthetic like look at me i'm like it really doesn't show on camera whatever and then i'm just gonna put like 
look at me i'm already forgetting what i'm about to do i'm gonna do this barley cream it is by Essence herb i got this in pr a while back but i still use it because i love the moisture it gives me it kind of like locks it in and after a long day at work i had some dry ass skin today so i need to moisturize a little bit i'm just gonna put it here and you guys please forgive me for looking a mess in these moving vlogs am i the only one that puts like the rest of the cream and like excess stuff in their hair because I do. Can't forget the neck. Today has been like a long day I feel like and I'm just tired. I'll show you guys right now what I'm talking about when I say that I don't wanna do anything. Like I honestly don't even wanna look. Where is my freaking um I was like, where are my lip products? I feel like I don't have shit. But really, I don't have anything anymore. Like, I barely have any lip products. I mean, I, I don't even fucking have, like, anything. What can I put on my lips right now? I mean, I don't have anything. Honestly, I don't. I thought I had, like, some chapstick. But I do. Do I have anything here that I can put on my lips? No, I'm not gonna fucking put that. Wow, well, yeah, I don't have no lip products. That's impressive. I showed you guys my bedroom reveal when I first moved in here, but it's a mess because I basically moved everything in here, and not only that. I don't have a fucking dresser, you guys. I don't have a dresser. I really want the Malm white dresser, but it's always sold out at the Ikea here in Houston. I just want the white fucking dresser. Like, that's all I want. Anyway, if you guys think I'm exaggerating, let me just stop. Like, I feel like I'm just like bitching at this point. Let me just freaking show you guys, okay? So, exhibit A, we have these boxes right here. So this, it's supposed to be all of my clothes that goes in the dresser. So I just have t-shirts, pajamas, like um, sports bras that I still haven't even worn. Um, I just, I have a lot of stuff, you guys. I don't even want to come over here, okay? I'm just wearing the same shit over and over again because I just, I refrain myself from coming here. <laughs> And then this bottom box that it's sitting on, literally, it's fucking heavy. And I already destroyed it. Look at me destroying my wall. Like, what the fuck, Alex? This is why you cannot have nice things. Down here, you guys see? Can you peek down there a little bit? Okay, so down there is all of my winter clothes. So all of my jackets, all of my coats, all of that stuff that I feel like I probably shouldn't have brought it over here, but I did, and I'm just fucking over it. It's giving me major anxiety. What else can I use if I don't have a dresser? Please tell me because I'm dying. Then I have more clothes here, and most of these clothes are dirty, but, but hear me out. These clothes are dirty, but I feel like I'm gonna donate most of the clothes that is in here, so that is why I don't even want to touch it just yet. I have clean clothes that goes in a fucking dresser that I don't have, so where can I put these clothes? Because I need help. I haven't picked up the camera now. It's been a few days. I've really just been busy with work. You guys know I work a full-time job. So sometimes it kind of gets a little bit complicated to, you know, get home and, you know, try to get some content and decorate throughout my home. But you guys didn't miss anything. I basically came back to my old place. I kind of had to do a little bit of cleaning, get the last few things that I have left here, but now it is completely empty. I am also going to turn in my case today. Like I said before, it is very emotional and I'm just like, I mean, I'm happy because just coming here does give me like bad vibes. It's just like a bad 
source of energy every time I come back to one, this side of town and two, just like here. So at the end of the day, I know I'm happy. It's like a new beginning. I literally have just, as you guys can see, it's empty, empty, empty. I just have one final bag here that I left. I left some hangers and I know I do need some hangers, extra hangers. So instead of me buying some, I just came to pick these up. I didn't even know I had an oven pan stuck in the oven, so I grabbed that. I literally had tons of tripods, you guys, in my closet over there um because i did empty that so i ended up keeping one all of my other tripods i just put them next to the dumpster so like people can just grab them um this little guy which is so special to me he's so cute i'm gonna bring him with me and some two pillows i'm gonna use those for my bedroom i have to stop by ikea so I can maybe grab some pillow covers and make it cute. Cause you know, you can never have enough pillows for sure. And then these two bags, literally brand new from Daisy Rose. This is the last box. Everything else is like little miscellaneous things. So, oh, and that's my clothes. I just need a moment for myself to say goodbye. Cause this is the last time, you guys, the last time I'm gonna be here. Last time. I want to show you guys the dining table. It's actually been a couple of days since I set it up, but I have been organizing, I've been cleaning, I've been trying to get my apartment together, so I know it's been a while, so please bear with me while I try to get by this moving process. I am going to link the dining table down below. I got this baby um, on Wayfair, and it's the entire set, so it already came with the dining chair. So let me give you guys a little overlook this way. Oh my God, you guys, it looks amazing. Don't pay attention to the box over there, <laughs> but it looks so good, you guys. It goes extremely well with the entire kitchen. I actually got these flowers gifted, so that's why I just decided to put them here. It kind of makes it feel a little bit more homey. It makes it feel better since I don't have a kitchen island. And you guys don't judge me because I've been in bed all day. <laughs> Let me turn on the light. Th this is real life, okay? I'm gonna make my bed, but as you guys can see, it's like very bright in here. But I got my dresser. I am so freaking happy. Um, I got this at Ikea. You guys know that I've been wanting this one for the longest time, but it's always sold out. Finally, I got my hands on it. I'm not gonna lie. I spent, I would say maybe six to eight hours building this guy. I got it last weekend, but I'm still organizing. Um, yeah, so I'm just really doing my best and getting all this stuff organized. I just have all of my t-shirts there. Like I said, I just love everything in my bedroom, just very simple. Um, so I don't know, I'm gonna probably put some decor. I'm not sure of it, but I mean, I got my dresser, you guys. I'm just so freaking happy. I think I'll probably make a separate video with that, um, just to kind of show you guys how to make the best of a smaller space. Sorry that this vlog came a little bit later than usual. For the next video, we are gonna wait for the TV console and then I have other exciting things coming. But I love you guys and I'll see you all in the next moving vlog. Bye.